Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to set Windows 10 or Windows 11 Professional or Higher Edition, so Professional Enterprise or Education, or Windows 10 Home or Windows 11 Home as well if you have the Group Policy Editor extension enabled. Um, how to make Windows notify you before downloading or installing Windows updates. So pretty straightforward process here, guys. And like I was alluding to, you're going to need to have the Group Policy Editor available for this tutorial. And you can get it for Windows 10 Home or Windows 11 Home Edition as well. But it's just not going to be covered in the scope of this tutorial. But assuming you have it, we're going to start by opening up the search menu. Type in Group Policy. Best match. Come back with Edit Group Policy. Go ahead and open that up. And now you want to go and expand underneath Computer Configuration. You're going to double click on the Administrative Templates folder. And you're going to do the same for the Windows Components folder. And then finally, you're going to locate a folder that says Windows Update. And going to go ahead and just left click on that once. Double click on the Manage End User Experience folder. And then locate where it says Configure Automatic Updates. On Windows 10, I believe if you expand Windows Update, there's only that one folder, and then on the right side, there wouldn't be all those subfolders. You just would look for configured automatic updates, so you wouldn't have to do that extra step at the end I just showed. But anyway, we're going to set this to enabled, and here's the deal. So if you click inside the drop down here, you got your options. So if you want to set it to 2, notify for download and auto install. 3, auto download and notify for install. 4, auto download and schedule the install. 5, Allow local admin to choose setting. 7. Auto download, notify to install, notify to restart. And 6 is missing from this list, so you know, 7, 8, 9 doesn't really apply in this case, but just wanted to give you guys a brief rundown. So if we're going to go a little bit deeper into this, so if we set it to 2, it just would allow Windows to notify the user of an app ready to be downloaded. And then once a user went to Windows Update, they could actually download and install any available updates. Three is the default setting, which if Windows finds updates, they automatically download them in the background, and the user will be notified when they're ready to be installed. Four automatically downloads the updates on a schedule, whatever the schedule is listed below. You can see below this drop down here. You can see it gives you a little bit of specification here. And a five basically allows the local administrator to use a configuration of their choice, and, but the local administrator will not be allowed to disable the configuration for automatic updates. And it says it over here on the right side too if you want to read through here. So they got text in here for Windows 10. It says version 1709. That sounds like a Windows 10 related update here. So a lot of legacy stuff in the group policy editor. Again, if you want to just set it to notify, I'm going to set it to two. You're welcome to select any option you want. But like I said, three is the default option in here. And you're going to select apply and OK. And then once you are done with that, you're going to go ahead and just close out of here. And you will need to restart your computer for the change to take effect. And that should hopefully be about it. So, as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.